All right, so let me quickly show you how to connect your controllers to play your PES or eFootball on your PC. The first thing to do before being able to play with your controllers on your PC is to ensure they are properly connected. For Ucom controllers, after the connection, ensure that the analog button is enabled. Okay, so now the next step is to launch your settings application. Once that's open, you go to the controller tab, and if the X input is selected, you change it to direct input. On devices, you select USB gamepad. Once you press your controller buttons, you'll notice that they do not correspond. Easy fix. Simply hold down the button on your controller and click the corresponding one on the application. Do this for all the mismapped buttons, save it, and then you'll be good to go. Now, for the PlayStation 4 controller, it can now be connected wired using the USB cable or wirelessly using Bluetooth. To connect it wirelessly, you first need to open up the settings application on your computer. Done that, then you click on Add Device under the Bluetooth section. Before going any further, you need to activate your controller's Bluetooth. To do that, you make sure you're holding out the share button and the PlayStation button simultaneously. And after exactly three seconds, you notice the light at the top of the controller starts flashing at intervals of two. And now you can proceed by clicking Bluetooth on the PC and then a device called wireless controller will pop up. Click on it and in a few seconds, your device will appear. Click on done. Now you can safely close your device settings and open your pairs or eFootball setting application. Do that and go to the controller tab and select controller 2 to start setting it up. Based on the same directions for the Ucom controller, make sure all the buttons and mappings are correct and then you'll be good to go. If you're looking for a place to get safe, reliable and affordable PC games, GameFund got you covered. For more information, visit their Instagram tag in the description.